Okay, very important place. Got the plaque here. Here is he walked by on the 10th, on the 16th of October, 1843. Sir William Rowan Hamilton, in a flash of genius, discovered the fundamental formula for quaternion multiplication. I squared equals J squared equals K squared equals IJK equals negative one, and cut it on a stone of this bridge. This is Broom Bridge, very important place in the history of mathematics. I'm just gonna to try to explain uh, that equation that we've got here. Obviously, this is an important bridge uh, in terms of the area as well. People still use it as a regular bridge for driving across and putting a train under, but yeah, okay, so. Here we've got a prop and I'm going to introduce two labels that are going to be very useful. This is what one looks like and this is what minus one looks like. Note that with one and minus one, the spoon is in the same position. It's just that my arm is kinked up with minus one. So first we're going to show I uh, and all of these I, J and K, they're all 180 degree rotations. So one multiply by I, that means rotate 180 degrees that way multiply by i again, and we get from one to minus one, which shows that uh, one times i times i, which is i squared, is equal to negative one. If we multiply by i again, we get to there, and then to there. So we can get from all, all the way from one to minus one. All right, j. One multiply by j, multiply by j again, multiply by j again, multiply by j again. Uh, and we also pass through minus one there. So one times j times j equals minus one. So my arm is kinked up. And k, this is the hardest one. k, what? No, not k, one. One times k times k. So we've got k squared. <laughs> this isn't cheating, okay. Times by k, and times by k gets you back to one. Uh, and of course, i, j, k. So, i, j, k. And we get minus one again. Yay. So there we are. There you go. Woo. That's quaternion multiplication.